Hold on one second. Brian, uh, I don't know if Kaiju's mic is on. Can you turn it on? Alright, speak. Not yet, not yet. Yo, Ryan! Two of us. Alright, you should be on now. Alright, alright. Six, six, six. So, um, you were saying that, like, you know, uh, PT claps uh, Steve. You're absolutely right. But the last time Noku and uh, GXQ played, G Noku, uh, Noku got three stock by the Steve every game he pulled it out. Yeesh. Okay, so maybe yeah. Noku doesn't got the uh, MU EXP or something, because, yeah. I mean, he didn't back then, but no, I think he did his homework because, you know, he won that game one against the Steve. Oh, okay, okay. So uh, it's not starting as smoothly for a game two, though. Uh, D Extreme has definitely uh, changed whatever, like, you know, he's doing wrong that last game to uh, make this a lot more difficult for Noku this game, too. I think it's definitely the stage. Wow. I think it's definitely the stage. Battlefield just makes like it's so much easier for Steve to just camp and get his materials that he wants. I feel like the added mobility of the platforms also helps like Steve approach better as well. I, like he just gets to like, you know, uh, be in the position he wants to be over PT more. Agreed. He gets to be above him, or is, uh, he gets to be like under him and forces PT to come, uh, you know, force an aerial approach. And then what does that equal? Free up tilts and up airs. I don't know what he was cooking there. I have never seen that one before. No. Oh no. Can Oku mass? He still makes it. Never mind. Okay, he's got a flare blitz. Nope. Okay, never mind. I think he said uh, he said we learned from that. We're not gonna flare this there. The block saving his life. That's not gonna close out the stock. Battlefield's slightly higher ceiling than uh, most uh, stages. Coming in clutch for uh, G Extreme there. However. No clue to still find the kill off the side. Oh, there's something about that back end. It just seemed like that back air seemed personal, man. Like <laughs> that, no, that Edzard back air is lethal. Yes, it is. It's just slurs, if you ask me. It is why I feel like I cannot sleep in peace at night. <laughs> I, I look over my shoulder thinking, is, is Edzard back air about to hit me? Yeah, you gotta like look over your shoulder and just check. It's like, shit. Am I safe? Am I safe to go to bed? Can I? Can I look away? <laughs> It's like no. a, it's a jump scare. You know who is not safe for sure though though. Noku who is oh actually. Oh he didn't go over the dare oh, Okay. I think yeah, Jesus Stream won a flesh jump? Possibly, I don't know. He's cooking up something in this pot of his right now. And Noku hitting out of the corner now. You a little hasty to uh, push into the advantage after like having just made it back to mid stage. Oh. Deep. Oh yeah. no, but the up smash. Tried to come down with an up air, and I usually know that always works, but it's a weak spike, not the strong dude. Yeah, that, like, I think G Extreme knew, like, even if uh, Noku found, like, you know, uh, did find the up air, like, conversion off of that down air, like, successfully, it, it, the risk reward of just, like, laying the up smash rip in case he does, like, you know, fumble the execution is too high for, or, like, him to not go for it. Mm hmm. No harm there. Oh, what song are we picking? Wait, are we going to Small Battlefield? Tekken music! Yes, yes sir. sir! 
And we got a lo the remix of Aloneness? I'm not gonna lie, the first time I heard this, I wasn't a fan of it because you know I like the original Aloneness better, but this one? It's good. It's got it, yeah. This one definitely gives me like the Smash vibe, you know? Okay. Now, personally, I wouldn't take Steve for Small Battlefield. I would say give me a flat stage or, get, or let me die. I feel like Battlefield against Steve in general is like a mistake. His, just the mat, like, you know, uh, output, output for him is so good on, like, you know, these kind of stages. Christ! Okay, but however, Goku it, coming back with a bit of a vengeance this game three, kind of uh, being a bit more aggro with uh, Ivysaur here. Ooh. Something definitely awoken this man here. Awake, awake is not even the word. He's angry. <laughs> he is angry. <laughs> On the stage, into the up air. Yep. What a whiff punish. <laughs> There's the Ooh. Razor Leaf, uh, the classic, like, electric wind god fist before there was electric wind god fist. That thing just <laughs> converts into everything. Literally, man. It's like, can you cook? No? Okay, let me give you Ivysaur Razor Leaf. There you go. Now you now you Gordon Ramsay approved. Oh, jeez. Ooh, but that back air is definitely certified. Certified robber too. Uh oh. Like a little rat pulling your hair. Getting back on the stage versus Ivy, so definitely proven to be like troublesome by G Extreme and the double spot dodge. My man, <laughs> he does not want to go in. Yeah, no, G Extreme's scared right now, bro. And I feel like Noku's giving him a bit too much respect. Yeah, I feel like Noku should just go in there, and just like no, hit him. I. I disagree, actually. I think Noku with this stock lead is in a good position to, like, you know, just force Steve into a box. Not, like, overextend Mayway, not give Steve any opportunities. This is actually the best position you could be in against Steve to, like, just barely allow any openings so that he, like, you know, can't start, like, his uh, snowball. Kaiju definitely dropping some knowledge I needed to hear. You're absolutely right, now that you mentioned it. Because if he did go in, he risked, like, you know, whipping the. whipping and die. Something like that happening. Yeah, yeah. Gather stretch the frames there, buddy. Oh, yep. Is he gonna Ivy go for coming the back out. Oh my god. I'm very happy he did not do the immediate up here right there because that would have been his stock. Oh, and this, yeah, this that is a scary situation to be in. One single diamond up tilt could look like your entire stock is gone. <laughs> Talk about a jump scare. Quite <laughs> clearly, Jesus. Uh, now he's at a percent where he can die. I think that's what we should call those fan footstools from now on. Oh, and speaking of jump scares, though, that uppy coming out from under. Closing out that second stock. The unreactable kill option from Pokemon Trainer. Oh, no. Yep. Big damage coming out right now. Nope. Not getting the sweet spot. Cashing out big time. Man. Just not letting G Extreme land. He is oh playing God. around this disadvantage so well right now, especially in jungle situations. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want to learn how to fight your demons right now, Noku PT is giving you proper notes. First, you dunk them, and then you fist bump them. You show them that like, I ain't scared of you no more. <laughs> Woo, Noku PT.